Hola beauties and welcome back to my channel. I am Ursula, AKA the Enhancer of Enhanced Beauty and I'm Chloe, her daughter. Today we have a very special video. We actually did a video like this a few years ago and Chloe has been on me to do another video to turn her into me. Okay, well, before we get into that, let's make sure you are officially a part of the squad by clicking that subscribe button and remember to click your notification bell. This video a thumbs up yes. and comment down below and share this video because sharing means caring. Yes. All right, without further ado, let's, let's get, get into, into the video. Okay, as you can see, I did clean up Chloe's brows. They were a bit thick and I'm sorry, I just had to. I just took a little bit off on the edge, that's it. I reshaped them. And y'all, I apologize, just disregard this noise. They're cutting grass. It's always that one when it comes to brows. Everything look all right? Everything look perfect. Okay. All right. Cleaned up the top part. I'm sorry y'all couldn't see that because my big arm is in the way. Now we're blending out this concealer. I'm using it as an eyeshadow base as well. Let's blend this other side. For those that don't know, Chloe does have an Instagram page at Tell them. Chloe's with a Z underscore closet with the king. Once you blend out your concealer, what I like to do is set it. So I'm using the Juvia's Place setting powder and I don't like it. Close your eyes. Keep them closed now. And make sure you set immediately after buffing out that concealer because what you don't want is for it to start creasing. The palette that I'm using today is the pizza palette. Let me just let you see what the pizza palette look like if this is your first time seeing it. And I am going to use this color as well as this color as a blend. And this is sausage and meatballs. I will tap the sausage and tap the meatballs. And that's it. I'm going to start on the lid and I'm just going to tap it in. Everywhere I want it on the lid, I'm going to slowly blend it upward into the transition area. This is it. Now that both eyes are done like that, you can use a clean brush to do this next step, but I'm just gonna use the same brush. And there's this light color right here. This color right here is called extra cheese. I am going to take it and just kind of barely tap this same brush in it and just kind of dust it right here to soften this area out going into her brow bone. I'm doing this look on Chloe, but you can actually do this on yourself. The next step, I'm going to create a wing liner. There it is, just a little simple wing liner. The next step, what I like to do before I apply my lashes, I like to put a little mascara on my real lashes just to blend them better. Chloe has really long eyelashes, but I'm putting lashes on her for the sake of the video. I'm turning her into me. Lashes that I'm using today. These are the I Envy Lashes number eight. Yes, they look long. They are long because they are the same ones that I am wearing. Y'all, she has this foam right here. Come here. So now what I'm doing is I'm putting a little liner. Close your eyes. Close, keep them closed. Wait, mama, you know what I could do? What? Yeah, Cause this is gonna be the time going on. Cause there's gonna be that do do thing. It's gonna video you putting on the lashes. Then I could be like, stop. I ain't ready yet. Okay. I'm 
me see. Open. Open your eyes, girl. Open. Since all of that is done. It's hard fighting with this camera. Chloe has the little bag lines just like I do. It runs in our family like I stated in the last video. So we just use a little color corrector to fix that. I like to blend this out with the beauty blender, actually a damp beauty blender. So I'm just spraying a little setting spray on it to dampen it a little bit. And if you notice, I'm just patting. I'm not wiping. I forgot to prime her face after I used the moisturizer. But the next step, I always take a little concealer. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in number 50 Cafe. And I just look up. I just kind of tap it right over that color corrector. Now it's time for foundation. I am using the Juvia's Place Foundation Stick in Namibia. Glory is skin, baby. You have great jeans. <laughs> Blending is not optional. Once the foundation has been blended out, you are now really ready to highlight and contour. I am using the LA Girl Pro Concealer and this is Warm Honey. This is my favorite for our skin tone. You're gonna take your same beauty blender, look up. All right, everything is blended out. What you wanna do also look up because Chloe ha is starting to crease. Before you set it with the setting powder, you go over it again. What you're doing is blending out those creases and immediately set it. I'm just tapping this setting powder in. You set with setting powder everywhere you highlight it with concealer. I prefer to just use powder bronzer to contour. And for that, I am using Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is the mahogany. And I am using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Blush Trio. I'm using this shade and it is velvet. I forgot to contour her nose. This is the Fenty Beauty How Many Carrots. This is gorgeous, y'all. I love it. You can't really see it's too bright, but it is beautiful. What I'm doing is just placing it right here. Turn that way. Right there. An exclamation point on the nose. I like to put a little dot right there on the tip and then right down the bridge. Now it's time to work the under eye. I am going to take my NYX pencil and black bean and put that in the waterline. Okay, so now what I wanna do is just kinda smoke out that lower lash line while she get herself together. And I'm going to use Sausage, the same brown that I put on the lid. Now we are ready for the lips. The way I created this lip, I am using Amore by Milani, and this is Honey Bunny. This is by Ruby Kisses, and you can get this at your local beauty supply store. So I am going to take the Amore and use it as a liner, a lip liner. Make 
your lips together a little bit. Get, blend that lip liner in. I'm going to place that honey bunny on the inside. And you really could leave it just like this if you wanted to. Nice, pretty ombre lip. She's not feeling it, but I'm going to throw a little gloss on the top. This gloss is by Black Radiance. It doesn't have a name, but the number is 5110. Once your lips are on, you are ready to set. always like to put a little shimmer right in the inner tear duct area and I'm going to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Jackiana palette and I am using trust issues and I'm just going to take that and just go right in the inner corner purple remember we are turning Chloe into me so in order to do that we need a few things the first thing is I have a mole right here on this right cheek. So I am going to take this liquid eyeliner and give Chloe a mole right here on this right cheek. Next thing is I have on hoops. Of course, she's not going to wear hoops this big, but she does have a they little. They are a little big for her, but just a little bit. And y'all see it coming together? Are we looking alike yet? Y'all see my little, it's a little clip because I haven't gotten a real deal right here. I'm gonna give Chloe that same little clip. And now. I have a child. Yeah. Her little mini me. That's right. So how did we do? Oh, the best friend, that's my best friend, that's my best friend. That's Y'all, Chloe has been what? Hashtag enhanced. <laughs> you too can be enhanced. By who? The enhanced. That's right. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment down below, share this video because sharing means caring. Make sure you follow <laughs> at enhanced underscore beauty. And I also have a fashion page at Curvy Girl Style Guide. And then they have to do what? Stay popping, YouTube. And I'll catch each of you in the next video. Adios, beauties. Adios.